Hey guys, Mike the Gaming Dad here and welcome back to the channel. This is episode 9 of my walkthrough for The Last of Us Part 1 on PC. And in this episode we're going to be taking on Chapter 7, uh, the Tommy's Dam chapter. Uh, the story has moved on a few months since the last episode. Uh, we're now in Jackson County in uh, the fall and yeah, we are looking for uh, Joel's brother. Uh, so we are going to get a new weapon um, quite early on in this uh, chapter. Um, so just buy this car um, after we've picked up these parts. Um, there is the El Diablo revolver on the floor. Um, which is it's probably going to come in useful actually in this episode. Because it is good for taking out headshots um, at a distance. So much for this road. You just follow the river. It'll lead us straight to Tommy's. Yeah, I don't think we're going to make it that way, so uh, let's just head down to the river. What happened between you two? What do you mean? You and Tommy. You're not together, so clearly something went down. We just had a bit of a disagreement, that's all. Ah, oh, here we go. <clears throat> so what was it about? Tommy saw the world one way, I saw it the other. And that's why he joined the Fireflies. Yeah, your friend Marlene promised him hope. That kept him busy for a while, but just like Tommy, he eventually quit that too. How was it? Last time you saw him. I believe his last words to me were, I don't ever want to see your goddamn face again. Jeez. Yeah, so just up this uh, little section us? here it's is going to be the first collectible well, in this chapter. Um, and this is comic book number seven. Let's just keep going. Um, just buy this overturned car here. Oh, there we go. I couldn't see the um, option to click it then. Uh, yes, foreign element this one's called. Um, and then now we can just head back down to the river and carry on forward. It is one of the shorter uh, chapters in the game this, um, but it is quite uh, challenging in parts. Um, it's got some combat elements in it um, and the enemies um, that you face in this episode tend to be well armed and uh, highly aggressive so hopefully we'll um, yeah, make it through unscathed. Whoa, what's that? Right there's a hydroelectric power plant. <laughs> uh, a hydro who? It, uh, it uses the river's movement and uh, turns it into electricity. Let's do that. Look, I know what it is, I don't know how it does it. All right. Yeah, so just up now here is a uh, shiv door as well. I don't think there's any collectibles in here, but yeah, there's quite a few parts and pills and things to pick up. I think that's everything. So we need to make it across the dam now, so we can turn uh, the first lever on this side, which is here. Um, but then we're going to have to help Ellie get across to uh, open up the second half. Um, so then that we're able to make it over ourselves. So once you turn this, um, if you, get the other one if you up, jump in the water, cross. there's a pallet that we can grab and um, that'll get um, Ellie across. Uh, it's just inside uh, this little uh, building here. I need you to... I know. Step on the fucking pallet. Got the impression Ellie's not too uh, pleased about having to keep doing this. Uh, there are a couple of uh, additional trophies you can get in this um, chapter as well if you're interested in that sort of thing. Um, so uh, the first one's actually just after this section here. Um, so when Ellie opens the oh, other side of the dam, um, you'll get what looks like an optional conversation prompt um, where Ellie goes for a high five. Um, if you don't, if you leave her hanging, 
um, and then just walk past it, you will get a trophy for it. It's kind of harsh, but I don't make the rules. Hey, be careful crossing that thing. I will. Teamwork. There we go. So if you leave a hang in there, you'll get a trophy for doing really? that. Just gonna leave me hanging? Alright. Let's see how it is. Switch to my five. Do you see five seconds? Poor Ellie. He's uh, <laughs> proper wounded. Um, so then we're going to come just down this little section here and this is where we, we are going to get the first optional conversation um, and this is optional conversation number 28 that's too small a grave i forgot to leave that stupid robot on the grave what should i do with it um, what i want to talk about it no why not how many times do we need to go over this things happen and we move on it's just that's enough all right I'm sorry. I kind of feel a bit bad for Ellie there. Like she obviously just wants to. I guess everyone's different, aren't they? Some people prefer to talk about it. Others just Get prefer to ignore it. I think Joel's more the uh, definitely more the second type. And Ellie just wants to get it off her chest, but Joel kind of just dismisses her. Uh, so you can either go up this way now, um, or you can go up the stairs. Oh, which are I know there, I am too. Um, right, and they'll both I lead you to this you. section. Uh, this it doesn't matter which one you take. Some food. Well, if I starve, you're responsible. Yeah, but we need to go under here, and there's going to be another um, collectible for us to pick up um, just before we go into the dam. Uh, should we head in? So if you head into you this little outbuilding here, um, you'll get the uh, artifact number 56, which is the power plant map. Um, along with a few uh, parts. There's the map. Um, and now we can enter the dam um, and we're going to get a short cutscene now. Don't even think about reaching for your weapon. Tell the girl to drop hers now. Ellie, do as the lady says. Okay. Please tell me you're lost. Oh, we, we didn't know the place was occupied. We're just trying to make our way through. Through to where? They're all right. But you know these people? I know him. He's my goddamn brother. Tommy. Holy shit. <sighs> What are you doing, baby brother? God damn. Yeah. Let me look at you. You get fucking old. Easy. It's gonna happen to you, too. This is Maria. Be nice to her. She sort of runs things around here. Ma'am, thanks for not blowing my head off. Would have been embarrassing, considering you're my brother-in-law. We all gotta get wrangled up at some point. Um, Ellie, right? Yeah. What brings you through here? Uh, that's kind of a long story. Why don't we bring him inside? Yeah. You hungry? Starving. They're friendlies. We've been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. So it didn't take us long to uh, find uh, what the hell Tommy. You doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joe. I had. We'll get her running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. So this is where so right back. the second optional conversation in this uh, yeah, section is. He likes when you cut his ears. Uh, you this is optional one? conversation I number 29. Watch. When have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston, this soldier back in the zone, he gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take You can pet here. Winston as well. Awesome. Um, it doesn't count towards a trophy, but... Um, there. Yeah. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No uh, sweat. A nice thing to do, I guess. All right, let's continue the tour. 
Yeah, so we're going to get a tour of the uh, inside Carol? now. Yeah. Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. Oh, no. You know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. It's just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right. Look, take it easy. Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? <sighs> I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Get some food in you. Joel. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. Come on. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week, and it feels like forever. And so there's another optional conversation uh, here as well, uh, uh, which is number 30. I got something for you. Last year I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone. Most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean... I said I'm good. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah, okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. Um, so Joel refuses the uh, picture of Sarah. It's really sad, isn't it? It's obviously 20 years on and he still... He still can't, like, deal with it, accept it. He'd rather just sort of bury it. Um, so Tommy's going to lead us to the right here, but um, if you just snake a left, um, first of all, and go into this little office at the end, um, there is some... Uh, stuff we can pick up in here and um, so there's some pills here and then I think there is um, parts and uh, some craftable uh, materials as well We've actually got a full full house of everything now, which is good, and we've still got a lot of parts. So uh, yeah, we're doing quite well on that uh, front. Um, so now you can head through this door, um, and then what you want to do is heard, um, Tommy will head to the we're left. Um, if you head to the Maria right, father, um, you'll get another optional conversation, which is number thirty-one, uh, just next to this woman Remember here. Doing. You're new around here. Yeah, Joel, I'm Tommy's brother. War travels quickly around these parts. <sighs> Apparently. I kind of see the resemblance. I see. It's a compliment. <laughs> it was a pleasure meeting. You too. <laughs> Joel having a little uh, flirt. He's only been here five minutes. He's already got himself a, uh, a lady admirer. <laughs> what do you do for protection? Adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when the plants open. Yeah, and then there's another um, though, right? trophy available here as well. But it's the world um, so when we just come through here, you're going to see a dog on the floor. Um, <laughs> yeah, if you, you pet like him, Marlene. you get a trophy for it. Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. Not much of a guard dog. Maybe good to have around. <laughs> That's a good boy. Always got time to pet a good boy. The easiest trophy you'll ever get. <laughs> These two geniuses are going to bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> uh, so the map that you they're looking at is a, a trophy, but we can't pick it up till later. Um, so we'll get sure. that on the way back. Um, but if you just come uh, through this ready. section here, there is a back. training manual to pick up. Um, training manual number eight. 
uh, which improves the duration of our um, smoke bombs. Um, and then there's a workbench here as well, although I don't think do there'll be a lot that we can upgrade. We might just upgrade the El Diablo because we are going to uh, use that in this section. Ah, we can only do the reload speed. I think we'll leave it there for now. We did we did quite a lot of upgrades in the last uh, episode. Yeah, that yeah, looks good. Uh, so we're now going to see them uh, try and uh, get the turbines back running. To the left. Watch it. Okay, that's good. Lower it slowly. All right, that's good. Tommy's here. We good to go? Give me one. Second! Okay, good to go. Ready? Go ahead, hit it. Here we go. Whoa. <laughs> God damn! We did it, boys! Nice work, boys. Somebody get on the horn and give Maria the good news. You see that? It's pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> All right, Joel. Um, and then before we go into this room Let's and go, talk to uh, Tommy, just head to the other side, um, just past the turbine, and, and into the room uh, just through here. Um, there is going to be uh, more parts and craftable materials to pick up, and another uh, collectible in this room as well. So this is Firefly Pendant number 18, um, which is just here on the floor. Uh, and this one belongs to Oli Oliverio. Olivero. Quite a nice uh, view of the mountains from here. Uh, so that's this section done with now. We can go and uh, talk to Tommy, which will uh, cue um, another uh, cutscene. Looks like they're weld welding that back together now. Quite the crew you got here. Yeah, they're good men. This place gives them a second chance. Gives us all a second chance. So why'd you leave Boston? I've been on quite the adventure, little brother. I reckon it's got something to do with that girl. <laughs> it's got everything to do with that little girl. Well, go on then. She's immune. Immune to what? I've oh, seen come her, on. I know, I've seen her breathe enough spores to take down a dozen men, and nothing. Now, I wouldn't have believed it neither, but I can show you. All right. I'll bite. Why bring her here? I was supposed to deliver to the Fireflies. The way I figure they're your boys. <laughs> You finish the job, you collect the whole damn payment. I haven't seen a firefly in years. But you know where they are. Now, I'm not asking for much, Tommy. I just want some simple gear, enough to set me on my way. What makes you think I'd do this for you? This isn't for me, Tommy. This is for your damn cause. My cause is my family now. You ain't talking about some walk in the park here. Jesus, boy. Have Maria get some of your born-again friends to do it. They got I... families, too. Tommy, I need this. You want some gear? Sure. 
But I ain't taking that girl off your hands. This is how you gonna repay me, huh? Repay you? For all those goddamn years I took care of us. Took care? That's what you call it? I got nothing but nightmares from those years. You survived because of me! It wasn't worth it. I bring you the cure from mankind, and you wanna play the pissy little brother? We ain't back in Boston. You lay your hands on me again, it won't end well for you. The hell is that? We're under attack. You still remember how to kill, right? Yeah. So we're gonna get attacked by raiders now. Shit. And yeah, they are heavily armed. Oh, a lot of them are wearing armor as well. Uh, so we're gonna try and move uh, quickly. Uh, So that's the two that are on the ground floor, um, and then there's a few that are above us as well. Oh, that's one of them done. than the second one. Got it. Got shot from the side then. Uh, threw me off. Right, that's the next one down. Cover me. Um, there's a guy there who's got a shotgun. Are you friendly? Oh, I guess not. I thought he was a friendly then. I uh, hesitated and then he uh, whacked me. Tommy, bandits are breaking into the building. Uh, so we can now pick up the uh, artifact, um, the plant uh, schematic map, uh, which is artifact number 57. God damn it! This looks pretty complicated. And so we're going to get attacked again by the next round of bandits. Um, they are quite far away, so I recommend using um, weapons with a scope if you can. And once we've taken down the first couple, I'll try and move uh, forward. I don't think we're going to have enough rounds to take out all of them. Yeah, we'll have to get up close. There he is. Come on, show yourselves. Tommy, cover me. I think we've got two more to deal with. Oh, maybe we can get more downstairs as well. That's one of them done. Hurry up! 
You're dead, asshole. Got him. I think that is that all of them. Tommy, cover me. Oh, no, there must be one more. I'm cycling through my weapons because I don't want to run out of um, Let's go. ammunition in any of them. We've got one left. Sons of right now we can uh, move in and uh, take out the get final the wave. Right behind you. Yeah, so Over the there. first one is just down Joe. here, he's deep to deal with. Do your thing. Guys would have taken him out then, but we were shooting him and nothing was happening. Tommy, cover me. Look out! Two more, and then I think we're done. Oh, lovely. Oh, they got him. They're all dead. Tommy? Maria? I'm all right. The kid's with me. That was too damn close. Yeah, it's not an easy uh, section that they, um, they're they all heavily armed. You okay? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. Oh, oh man. They were coming in from every direction. Then Maria was like, we got to run. And so we dove over these tables and this huge guy blasted with slow a down, shotgun. Slow down, slow down, Listen, then... hey, hey, are you hurt? No. God damn it. I need to talk to you. Absolutely not. You tell him to go find somebody else. Maria, I can't have this hanging over my head. Do you have any idea how many men we lost here today? Hey, what's that all about? Does that have anything to do with me? We'll talk about it later. Did he tell you where the lab is? We'll talk about it later. I know those roads. I've been there a million times. Later. Right. It takes one. One fuck up. One fuck up and then I turn into one of those widows, okay? I have to do this. I don't know what else to say. Fine. Maria. Maria. Here we go. You. If anything, anything at all happens to him, it's on you. She's thankful, you know. Yeah, I know. I'll take that girl of yours to the Fireflies. You don't have to worry about it. It's best this way. Well, maybe some real good will come of this. I need to talk to Ellie. Say again, I didn't hear you. Joe! What, what is it? That girl of yours, she took one of our horses and rode off. Damn it, which way? Come on. I just saw her riding on out of here. Go back inside. Help the others clean the place up. Okay, be careful out there. There, see the tracks? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> right, just as soon as uh, Tommy has agreed to take uh, Ellie for us, Ellie's done a uh, runner. Uh, so we're gonna have to go after her now. Mm -hmm. 
now I feel like I'm playing uh, Red Dead Redemption 2 or something. And uh, now we're on horseback. She couldn't have gotten far. We'll find her. Don't worry. That's another one of my uh, all-time favorite series. She that. usually pull these stunts. Nothing like this. What's going on? So we just need to head down here. There, more tracks. Yeah, just follow the tracks. They're quite easy to spot. Let's go. Yeah, we are going to get ambushed <laughs> shortly, and the um, hunters that attack us here again, um, quite difficult. This section, um, they are highly aggressive, and yeah, use things like molotovs and um, yeah we'll rush you so yeah be be on your guard whoa, 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 whoa. I got your back how many you see too goddamn many yeah, we're actually for the first Go time I'll cover you. we're we're actually quite low on oh damn I didn't uh, didn't expect him to come so uh so quickly just heal myself um yeah we are we're quite low on ammunition aren't we for the first like time run, in this uh <laughs> series we're gonna have to um uh, start sneaking around and conserving ammunition again i think Tommy is taking him out. Watch my back. Go! We are. Yeah, we're not doing too good here. We're, um. Quite a lot of damage. <laughs> For that. Uh, I think I'm going to, yeah, we'll just restart the encounter and um, what I'm going to do this time is I'm going to stick down here. Um, I think, yeah, I shouldn't have rushed forward so quickly. Um, instead, we're going to try and let them come to us. Um, yeah, I said uh, be, care be careful in this section because the enemies are highly aggressive and then I just walked into pretty much every uh, every hunter that um, came forward. If we can, uh, yeah, whittle the numbers down from back here, it'll be a lot easier when we do need to move uh, forward. Ah, uh, yeah. So they are they're coming to us, which is um, we're able to pick them off a lot easier uh, doing it this way. Damn, we missed. We were doing a uh, doing quite well up to there with uh, saving our ammo. Got him. I think we're down to the last one. Come on, show yourself. Oh, 
me if I can get him from here. <laughs> I managed to shoot the uh, the top of the um, wooden plank off, but it didn't do any damage to him. I'm not sure the uh, armor-piercing rounds wouldn't have uh, hit him there, but oh well. To the horses. Um, right, so before we jump back on horseback, I'm just going to have a look around uh, the the buildings up here to see if there's anything we can pick up. To this building. I thought there might be more to pick up than um, than that, but oh well. Yeah, so we can get uh, yeah get back on our horse now and then carry on forward. It does look like Ellie came through get here on. with the uh, track, so. Hopefully the um, none of the hunters followed her. Come. On. Tracks keep going this way. Let's hope they didn't get to her. Getting a Red Dead Redemption vibes here. Yeah, come on. Look, by the ranch. That's our horse. She's got to be there. There he looks clear. Be careful. Um, so Ellie's going to be on the second floor. Um, but when you get to her, it will start a uh, cutscene. So um, before you do that, make sure you have a good um, scale Ellie. around of the downstairs first um, and pick up everything Ellie. before um, you do head upstairs. Christ. I'll keep an eye out. Reckon you guys need to have a chat. Quite a large uh, ranch, this isn't it? Oh wow, look at that rat! Ah, oh, finally some ammunition. That's good.
there is a collectible to pick up downstairs as well. Um, Firefly pendant number 19. Um, just trying to remember where it actually is. Don't think it's in the kitchen area. We'll just have another. I could have missed it. We'll just have another quick look around. Yeah, it's not on these. It's in the fireplace. No. Ah, oh, maybe it's on that table there. Ah, oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, Firefly pendant number 19. Um, and this one belongs to uh, Brent Pino. Yeah, the one, the one corner of uh, the one room that I didn't check. Uh, we can head upstairs now. Uh, there is another collectible to pick up here as well. Um, and it's just in this um, room here to the left. Uh, this is comic book number eight, um, zero point. Um, and that is the last of the collectibles in this uh, section. But this ranch looked amazing back in the uh, before the outbreak. It's absolutely enormous. Oh, so it's prompting us now where Ellie is. Uh, she is in that far bedroom at the end, but um, yeah, don't enter until you've picked up everything, because otherwise you won't. Um, I don't think you can do it then. Right, so now we can uh, enter the bedroom. We're going to get quite a uh, emotional cutscene now. Is this really all they had to worry about? Boys, movies, deciding which shirt goes with which skirt. It's bizarre. Get up. We're leaving. And if I say no? Do you even realize what your life means? Huh? Running off like that, putting yourself at risk, it's pretty goddamn stupid. Well, I guess we're both disappointed with each other then. What do you want from me? Admit that you wanted to get rid of me the whole time. Tommy knows this area. Oh, fuck that. Well, I'm sorry. I trust him better than I trust myself. Stop with the bullshit. What are you so afraid of? That I'm going to end up like Sam? I can't get infected. I can take care of myself. How many close calls have we had? Well, we seem to be doing all right so far. And now you'll be doing even better with Tommy. Not her, you know. What? Maria told me about Sarah. Ellie? And... You are treading on some mighty thin ice here. I'm sorry about your daughter, Joel, but I have lost people too. You have no idea what loss is. Everyone I have cared for has either died or left me. Everyone fucking except for you. So don't tell me that I would be safer with someone else because the truth is I would just be more scared. You're right. You're not my daughter. And I sure as hell ain't your dad. And 
we are going our separate ways. Get it together. We're not alone. I got two walking. There's more inside already. Right, we're gonna have five more bandits to deal with now, but this um of the the three combat sections in this chapter, this is by far the easiest. Um, because they they split up and generally look around different sections of the house um, individually so you can pick them off. So that's one down, so I'm going to try and save our ammunition here if I can. Um, yeah, just going back to that cutscene. Um, yeah, Joel doesn't. He doesn't get it, does he? Like Ellie's. Yeah, Ellie just doesn't want to be abandoned again. And that's the second one done. Um, the three, the three that are left are all downstairs now. Hang back. Um, yeah, he thinks Joel thinks he's doing the right thing by passing her over to Tommy, but. She, um, yeah, she just sees it as like Joel's just leaving it. Anything? No, nah, man, I got nothing. Says, No, man, I've got nothing, just as we are grabbing around the neck. The irony that the um, one of those two hunters then just shouted to his buddy, "We're being hunted." Uh, now you uh, you came to us. Down. I think we've just got the one more left to do now. I'll just wait for him to um, go into that room and then we'll uh, choke him out. Alright, house is clear. Get back to the horses. Right, and that's uh, that little section done with. Um, yeah, it's, it is a lot simpler that one than the uh, the previous two. We're clear. There she is. 
kids will be watching movies tonight. Where is this lab of theirs? It's all the way out, University of Eastern Colorado. Go Bighorns. Haley, get off your horse. Give it on back to Tommy. I'm gonna hang on to this fella, that's all right with you. Oh, don't make me repeat myself. What are you doing? Your wife kind of scares me. <laughs> I don't want her coming after me. Sorry for stealing your horse. Well, come back to town. Let's discuss it at least. You know me, my mind's all made up. University, Eastern Colorado. How do I find this lab? It's in the science building. Looks like a giant mirror. You, you can't miss it. Take care of that wife of yours. There's a place for you here, you know? You good? I'm good. Adios, little brother. Um, so as soon as... Yeah, we've okay, met Tommy. We we're uh, leaving again. If you mess up your fourth down, then you Joel get the ball to obviously had a change of right, heart. And if you clear the ten yards, then you're back. Um, yeah, couldn't bring himself to leave Ellie after that's all. Right. Yeah, that's um, so we are. Uh, that is the Tommy's dam times. section done now. So we're sense. on to the next episode, uh, the next chapter now. Sorry, um, which takes place at the University of Eastern Colorado. Um, so I am going to uh, pause this episode here now guys um yeah thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed and i will see you next time <laughs>